Hi, my name is Redlin and I play baseball. I started since I was three years old and ever since I've been getting better and better. You know how normal people will set up and our necks are facing you know, the pitcher. We can turn our heads to face the pitcher to get ready. In his case, he only has a certain amount of degrees to look towards the pitcher and then he looks out of the corner of his eye to look at the ball to come his way, which is really difficult for him because he only sees partially of the ball coming his way. When Rylan was born, um, he was diagnosed with jarko levin syndrome. It makes my chest bulge out and it makes my body little. I don't have that much ribs. The ribs that I do have are stuck together. It makes me hard to breathe when I run. Several doctors said no to any sports, football, baseball, basketball, but um, his current doctor said that baseball would be the only sport he could play. He was around three or four and we decided to put him in baseball just to, I guess, get him around other kids, you know? We didn't want to treat him like anything was wrong. He was in T-ball, actually, like four or five. That's when we start noticing his, his gift, I guess you could say. Uh, when he gets up to the plate, you know, he did his own little stance. We didn't have to teach him that. He got ready. When, we saw, uh, when he's in the outfield, baseball ready, he got ready. I didn't really have to uh, tell him anything. And that's when we kind of figured out he's going to love, love, love this game. I want to make it to the MLB like Altuve. I saw Altuve and he was small like me, so I wanted to be just like him. He always says the quote that Jose Altuve says, it's not the size of the player, it's the size of the game. And Ryland strongly believes that he has game, just like Jose Altuve. What does he say? The biggest dynamites come in the smallest packages. <laughs> yeah. He also calls them the big me. We were at the Astros game front row seat. I forgot what it's called, but you get to go in like a little club thing. I was looking at the door and then when Altuve walked in, I just my mouth dropped and I didn't know what to say. I couldn't speak. I signed one of my baseball cards from picture and then he gave me his grand slam ball that he hit a grand slam with and he signed it and then he gave me his own bat. Rylan, Tyler Naquin here from the Reds, man. Just wanted to reach out, let you know that uh, there's some people out here thinking about you, man. We're here in Milwaukee with the Reds. Keep playing, you'll be out here one day. What's up, Rylan? Tucker Barnhart here, buddy. Hey, man, Kyle Farmer. How you doing? What's up, dude? I'm Jesse Winker, man. Hey, you're an all-star on our team, buddy. You can, play, uh, you can play for us any day of the week, man. I want to be an inspiration to kids that are sick and that have health issues like me. I know when Rylan says he wants to be an inspiration for other kids and for kids with health, his sister is a big, he, she's one of them. Mm -hmm. um, he's watched her go through like some of the hardest times in her life. Um, she was on the ventilator. She had a tracheostomy. She still has a feeding tube to this day. Um, and not once does he doubt her. He, he just teaches her to keep going, to be strong. Um, there was a time she didn't have a voice, like she couldn't talk uh, because of the tracheostomy being in her neck. And every single day, Rylan would come into her room and read a book to her. Like he was determined that, that, he, that, that his little sister was gonna learn to talk. And fast forward to now, and she doesn't stop talking. <laughs> When my days get hard, I just look at him, just watching him go through all that and make it and not even fuss about it. He's my inspiration, 100%. There's no doubt that he's my idol, he's my superhero.